How's it going YouTube? Today I'm going to be playing for you Luminal Parkour 2. This is a sequel to one that I've already played on my channel. This was one that I thought was pretty cool. Played this uh, maybe like two weeks ago, something like that on stream. So I'm pretty excited to be playing this one. But yeah, it's... As you can tell, it's a bit of a modded parkour. The, the dude that made this, made this, excuse me, I got tripped up on my words. The dude that made this, he's the guy that seems to make all these parkours that have, uh, these things. Oh, come on, dude, you just bumped me into that for no fucking reason. Thank you for stepping into me. No, it's not that big of a deal. But, uh, the guy that made this, he, he makes, like, he makes, I don't know, all these weird parkours that say, like, um, it's, like, modded parkour, and, like, the, the letters have, like, all these crazy, like, dashes and shit through them. I'm not really sure, like, obviously he's drawing, you know, inspiration from letters from other alphabets and stuff, hence the reason they've got all the crazy markings and shit on them. But yeah, this dude's definitely, definitely all about using these fucking radar beacons and stuff, which they're not really that hard to get around. That dude just bumped me into it a second ago, so we're gonna get it this time. Oh, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get this shit. But yeah, the first time I played this, I was just like, fuck, like, this is basically just the same parkour that I played, like, it's like the modded parkour number 55 or some shit like that. I don't know. It's, he, he uses, like, basically the same names for every parkour, but yeah. So anyways, this is pretty cool. It's kind of early in the morning for me to be making this. I just, I've got to work today, and <clears throat> I'm not, like, going to sit here and, like, be like, oh, you know, I just care about my fans so much and stuff. But I do give a shit about actually, like, putting up videos every day. To the best of my abilities, that's that's bad. Just got zapped. I try not to try not to take too many days away, like from from not uploading. So, one make sure I got one of these in before I went to work. See, so, yeah, I'm making this before I have to head into work. But anyways, anyways, let's do this. I love electrical parts. This dude's not going. He's getting zapped. <laughs> Look like he just slipped on a fucking banana pill. <laughs> oh, he slipped on the fucking banana pill again. Come on, dude. Gotta wear no slip shoes for these parkours. That was cringy. Just excuse me. It's 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 very early in the morning. My dude's not climbing onto this thing. Um, I'm just my cringe meter is like at the fucking maximum capacity right now. I've got to I've got to let off some cringy ass jokes, you know, to to get the day started. Hey, cool. Nice. Uh, yes. Yes. Nice. Uh, nice decision. Nice decision, friend. Very good decision to uh to jump and then step over the electrical thing. You're only like a thousand feet in the air. That's good. This is <laughs> for getting in my way. Dude, you're not. You guys, if you guys ever play parkours with me or whatever and you think that you're getting in my way or that you have to apologize for accidentally like bumping into me, please don't. I, I really 100% I know that like <clears throat> I know that like I complain about in the videos and stuff, but that's strictly for entertainment purposes. I don't I don't really give a shit if somebody bumps into me or like if somebody is like standing quote unquote in my way. Like you guys are here to do the parkour too, and I'm not gonna be like a dick about that. Okay, I should have ran earlier. <laughs> oh, oh, I should have fucking ran earlier. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? So okay, there's like six minutes left to complete this. I have done this parkour before, so this is um this is something that I know is within my capabilities. I just gotta I gotta put my nose to the grindstone and focus. No, I've, I've actually got an excuse for why this, why I'm, why I'm sucking so bad right now. I went to McDonald's with my girlfriend to get breakfast, and then I was supposed to get a bacon, egg, and cheese McGriddle, and they gave me a fucking bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit. And I'm not one to complain because you know I, I'm not a very picky eater. But uh, oh, go 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 go. But come on, man, I was super looking forward to that McGriddle, and then they they fucked it up, gave me a biscuit instead, and you know I just I haven't recovered since. It's so, all right. Let's see if we can get my dude to actually walk through this. I don't know what's up with these, like, electrical parts. Sometimes they'll let my dude, like, run straight through it, and then sometimes he just fucking stands there. There we go. Nice. I hadn't played this in a while, so I, I was thinking that I had to, like, walk up on that, but it appears that such is not the case. Oh, fucking Christ. I forgot about these things. I hate windmills. <laughs> I hate them so fucking much. Um... Let me stand over here on the edge, because I, I'm almost positive I can't bypass that shit in the middle. Oh my god, that was close. Okay, yeah, there was like a, a, a parkour that I played forever ago, and it was called like impossible, or 1% impos possible parkour or something. Oh, these dudes, please don't jump into me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god. 
that dude, that, okay, so, like, I was saying that I don't care if somebody bumps into me, but, like, bro, if that dude would have knocked me into that windmill, those have been fighting words. Alright, there we go. What was I saying? Oh, yeah, there was a, there was a parkour I played forever ago, and it was called, like, 1% Possible Parkour, and it was, it was a fucking, it was a hard parkour, like, I'm not even gonna exaggerate, that thing was fucking hard. And, of course, there's another windmill. My dog is whining. This is this is turning out to be a fantastic morning. No, I'm kidding. All right, one, two, three. Oh, okay, yeah. So I was playing that one percent parkour, the one that I was talking about. I keep getting distracted because there's so many fucking windmills. I can't really like try to do the try to talk and like do the windmill at the same time, or I'll instantly fuck up. But I played a the one percent parkour, and there was a part where you. How do I do this? There was a part where you have to like jump across a windmill but like you have a very limited range of where you can jump and I could not get past that shit ever ever I tried so many times and I just could not fucking do it so I always get kind of like nervous whenever like the whenever the jumps are like set up really close to the center of the windmill because there's like there's just like no way to do it I don't I don't feel like anyways can I can I go this way this will this will work we'll do this nice but no shit, I, I totally, totally 100% do not mind if people bump into me, but like, if you bump into me and knock me into a fucking windmill, that, that might be different. I might be a, l a little salty with that. I might be salty like some fries. Like the fries at McDonald's, where they gave me a, a fucking biscuit instead of McGriddle. I don't even know how you mis m like mix up those words. Biscuit, McGriddle, they don't even sound the same. Oh my gosh, people. Fucking people at McDonald's constantly ruining my fucking orders. It's the truth, though. It's the truth. I, I believe in treating people with dignity and respect and stuff, you know. It doesn't matter if they work at fast food or not, but come on, don't fuck up my order. Constantly. They always do that. So yeah, it looks like we made this. What is it? Corex made it again, boys. Yasix made it again, boys. No, I'm kidding. I, I'm, not, I'm not one of those people. I can't say that. I, I feel fucking retarded when I say that. All right, let's go up here and get these guns. Got some people that complain about me not uh, not shooting people or whatever, so we're gonna change this shit up today, boys. We're gonna start laying down the truth, laying down some fire. Although I'm pretty sure the other, let me blow this dude up. This is gonna be hilarious. Give me the, boom! Hey, what's up? <laughs> he totally did not expect that, I'm sure. It was not, it was not out of hatred. It was just out of getting rid of that losing streak. Plus, he was standing where, or he was sitting there with the, uh, the helicopter where the guns were. I had to, oh, don't do it, man. Don't do it. Why are you going to do that, man? That's so rude. That's just so rude. That's so rude. Is that, are those the only rifles that they gave us? If so, that's stupid. They were just like chilling there. I, I think that he, uh, I think he may have been like sending a me sending a message saying that he was um, not gonna kill me. Hey, my teammate got the guns. I see a dude with a, a, I see a blue helicopter. So that's surely gonna work out pretty well for us. Hey, cheats! I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that at all. Hey, the, I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's fucking let's do this again. Let's do this in like a minute. Let's just run past these windmills. Ain't no big deal. It's just a windmill. That's gonna knock me off. Gosh damn. Gosh darn. These damn windmills. Okay, so that that was actually a lot easier than I thought it was. Got past the windmills like it was nothing. I'm clearly just really good with windmills. No problem, right? Oh my gosh, just still going. Still going. Still going. Are we gonna do this? Are we gonna do this in 57 seconds? Are we going to do this in 57 seconds, guys? Can we do this? Can we made it again, boy? <laughs> oh, the cringe. The cringe. Alright, let's do this. 38 seconds. We're, we're... It's going to be crazy if I do this in, like, literally just a couple minutes. Like, come on. Like, I, I was struggling with this shit, like, so much. And, like, here it is. Just, like, super easy. No problems. We're going to do this in, like, two minutes. All because that windmill, like, knocked me up into, like, the area where I didn't even have to, like, do the electrical shit. You're a beast. You're a beast. You know who's not a beast? The people at McDonald's who fucked up my order. McGriddle, Biscuit. They don't even sound the same. I don't even know how many times I have to say that. 
Let's go. Oh my god, did we do it? We did it. Just jump straight off. Fuck it. We made it again. Fuck it. Okay, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully you guys uh, decide not to d unsubscribe to my channel because uh, it was really, really cringy and corny throughout the whole entire time. Did it just say that we won? How the fuck did we win? I don't know, but let's look at that. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Thank you guys for watching.